Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. I decided to do something a little bit different. Um, I'm sure that every once in a while it gets boring just watching a single unboxing. So I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven boxes. So let's get started. Now, if you're new here, welcome. And if this is not your first time visiting my channel, welcome back and I'm glad to have you back. My name is Tammy and we're gonna have some fun today. I'm gonna do something a little bit different. I've got seven boxes here, um, different. I think everything is basically a different category, so a little bit of something for almost everybody. Um, and price points anywhere from $15 to $50. So without further ado, let's get into it. We'll start off with the houseplant shop. Now the houseplant shop is a monthly subscription box for plants. And in this box, you will get a new plant every month, or they do have a variety of choices for you. You can do anywhere from an air plant or a succulent to a tall indoor or outdoor plant. And I get the indoor plant and the it is the pet friendly version and I get the cheaper one. So this one is $15 a month. So there it is. That one was wedged in there really nice. So there's my plant for the month of April. Oh, and all these are April boxes and I have cause box and that's the only um, that's the only seasonal box so that's a spring one. So our plant this month is a staghorn fern. Originates in Asia, South America, Australia, and New Guinea. Prefers the 60 to 70 degree temperature. Full sun. And on the back sides of these cards it gives you just that basic description and care. And then our, they also send a card with a print on it. That's the only purpose of it. It's just for the print. Love grows here. The house plant shop with Greg, which is an app. Greg is an intelligent plant assistant app. So if you have plants, go check them out. This one actually came very well watered. It looks very healthy. Um, there's a few leaves that have some dark spots to it, but after I clean that up, I think that will work out just fine. Okay, what's next? Okay, what should we pick next? Let's do Little Passports. Okay, so Little Passports is a monthly subscription that is a learning subscription for your kids. And each month you get some sort of activity for them to do. And Little Passports is $25 a month. And I get an extra edition on mine. And I get the book with it and that's an extra $10. So mine is $35 with the book, but it's normally a $25 a month subscription for the tier that I have. Now you can choose by age, you can choose by category. So categories like science and technology, math, art. Which one do we get? We get the science one. Science and engineering. So we get a lot of experiments and we get a lot of building. And this month, we get to find out about the human body. But this is the book that you get with your 
with that additional ten dollars and it's just your basic informational geared towards the younger classes geared towards those that are in elementary and middle school mainly and then here's our, our project information and in this you will get you'll get your directions for your project and just a little um, comic it's a little this one is the workbook but it has comics in here and there's the comics and then you have oh, this one you can draw out the blood flow and a word search and your glossary with pictures and here's our instructions it looks like we will be making pumping lungs and a beaten heart so that's neat look at this there's your heart on that side and your lungs on this side and then each month you get a sticker to add to your passport or um, poster or something that we lost in the very beginning and then in this you have all of your items you need to make your beaten heart and your pumping lungs so you'll get a cut out string craft to do your to do what is this for your heart I'm gonna guess to do your heart and then this is going to be for oh goodness looks like everything possible came out of here so in here we've got some balloons we've got some putty we've got some zip ties and some tubing and an already cut plastic bottle with a pre-drilled hole so that was my little passports for the month of April that is gonna be a fun one and again that starts out at actually the start is about $20 15 to $20 I believe that's when you get into the younger um, categories and then as you get into the older categories then they go up I want to do chocolate next so we're gonna open cacao this is a monthly luxury chocolate subscription this is small batch chocolate from different artisan shops around the world Okay, so they send this with it. This is how to properly enjoy your chocolate. So we have five different chocolate bars. Um, I did not tell you the price, I'm sorry. This is $40 a month. So let's start this up. And since I'm doing a mass unboxing, I'm not gonna try these all out. The first one is Pump Street Chocolate from Bakers and Chocolate Makers in Suffolk, England. And this is 58% Madagascar milk. Our creamiest, most luxurious milk chocolate is made with whole milk, which in combination with the zesty Madagascan beans reveals tasting notes of caramel, treacle, treacle, not sure, dried fruits, and creme fraiche. Yum. Can't smell anything. Next up, we have tahini, organic 47% milk chocolate. And this is by Nave. This legend is about a flavor that traveled 1001 nights all the way through the red Sahara dunes, mirages, and oases. This flavor is in a cave 
the mouth of which is sealed by magic and only the poor lumberjack um, Ali knows how to remove the spell and open the spellbound gate. So, yeah, that's cool. They These ones aren't very big, so this would be like a half size chocolate bar. And this would be more like a snack size for me. Like, I'll eat this with one book. I, that won't last multiple books. Okay, chocolate number three by Madakase, Beyond Good, Heirloom Chocolate, and this is Salted Almond. There's good and there's beyond good. Prepare to take your taste buds beyond the same uninspired flavor you find under every other chocolate wrapper. We are beyond good, both in name and in practice, from the unmatched flavor of our heirloom chocolate to ensuring cocoa farmers prosper with our direct trade and made at the source mission, we know you'll feel beyond good about buying this bar. To left, okay, chocolate bar number four. This is from Letterpress Chocolate in Los Angeles. And this is their Coco Camille Tanzania 70% dark chocolate. And with letterpress chocolate, we hand sort, roast, crack, winnow, grind at least 48 hours, age for at least a month, then temper, mold, and wrap all of our bars in-house to, to bring out the purest expression of each bean we source. Tasting notes of green banana and peppery mocha. Cool. Excited to try that one. And the last chocolate bar we have is from Potomac Chocolate, and this is their toasted milk, pure milk chocolate, and handcrafted in Occoquan, Virginia. Intensely creamy milk chocolate with rich notes of caramel, highly addictive. The cacao origins are the Dominican Republic and Peru. Yummy, I can't wait to get into the, oh my goodness. I am excited to get into that chocolate. Let's do Fruit for Thought. Fruit for Thought is an odd subscription. It's a lifestyle subscription, but it's not your normal average lifestyle subscription. They base their subscription themes around a different fruit or food each month. Last month was dill pickle. The month before that was strawberry shortcake. And you guessed it. I don't remember exactly. Now I do remember it was like either apricot or peach something. And this is their presentation. First glance. Ah, peachy apricot is their theme for this month, so I kind of was right. Next month for May, the theme is lemon lime. So in their box on the back side of their card, they will list everything that's in here. And fruit for thought is $40 a month. Okay, first thing I pull out is this cute little case here and it is an eyeglass case, complete with glasses, your eyeglass case, and your sunglasses. Next, we have a cast iron wax warmer set with deliciously scented wax melts. And the scent is in orchard peach. This is really cute. It's a little mini cast iron pan. I love this. And then here's the base. So you'd set that on there. You'd put your wax melts, which smell like peach, in there. Not like that, obviously. And then you'd put a tea light down here. And that would melt these and smell so... That is... A, that's adorable. I... I love this. This is adorable. 
so with this, we couldn't be more excited to include classic farmhouse candles cast iron wax melt set with a cast iron wax melter and orchard peach wax melts. We threw in a few tea lights for you to get started melting and scenting your house with fresh peaches. Well, I don't see them off top of my thing, but there's a lot of stuff in here. Okay, next up, apricot freesia goat milk whipped sugar scrub from Blue Heron Farms. And this is one of my personal favorite scrubs is made with fresh goat milk by Blue Heron Farms, Indiana. The apricot freesia scent they've made for us has a hint of spring freshness and a blend of bright freesia and apricot. Okay, next up we have an apricot fruit bar that tastes like a piece of pie. And this is Betty Lou's. This is from Betty Lou's. Um, this month's yummy treats includes Betty Lou's Inc. Delicious apricot gluten-free all natural fruit bar with the taste of homemade cobbler and Fruit Bliss Organic Soft and Juicy Turkish Mini Apricots. Organic, dried, and pitted. All right. And then the last thing was our substitution. And this is from Eclair Lips. This is a 100% natural peach pie flavored lip balm. Next, since we did a bunch of food stuffs, let's do, let's do makeup. So we'll do BoxyCharm. BoxyCharm is a monthly makeup subscription, makeup and self-care beauty um, subscription. This is $25 a month. I get the base box. You can get the premium box and that is $35 a month. And with the base box, you get five multiple size items. And again, this is for the month of April. So there's my first impressions. This month's theme is Sweet Treat. And on the back of their card has the product information on there and they do have retail values. So first thing up, I have a pencil from Aurora in espresso this is okay this is an eyeliner pencil and you can't really tell the color barely but that's a very dark brown with the aurora eyeliner pen if you've been looking for a long lasting smudge proof eyeliner then look no further the aurora intensively precise eyeliner in espresso gives you an all natural matte finish that lasts up to 24 hours made with German ink technology to ensure a flawless finish with an ultra fine felt tip. The natural ink formula is 100% free of alcohol and won't smudge. This gorgeous liner provides a smooth and luminous look for any occasion. Safe for sensitive eyes and this is a $12 retail value. But apparently it is a duo tip so I'm guessing you can take this out and flip it around. I'm not sure why I'd want to do that. Okay, whatever. Not terribly excited about this one. Next up from Natasha Denona, we have an eyeshadow palette. This is their Ayana eyeshadow palette. So that's pretty. The Natasha Denona palette is a special edition palette created, created exclusively for BoxyCharm, featuring five ultra pigmented neutral cool tone shades in a range of muted browns with a touch of sparkling metal green tourmaline. And this retails for $48. All right, next up we have by Touch and Soul. Yes, Touch and Soul Pretty Filter Icy Sherbert Primer. That's gorgeous. That is so pretty. And the lid here is a silicone not quite so it's a 
plastic lid. And this is a primer. So with the Touch and Soul Pretty Filter Icy Sherbet Primer, lock your looks in place and keep them cool with Icy Sherbet Primer. This gel primer has an instant cooling effect once applied that hydrates and preps skin for makeup. The formula is silicone free with water capturing technology to lock in moisture and leave your skin feeling silky, silky smooth. And this is $32. So next up we have from Mana Kadar Beauty, a two-piece tweezers set. And it looks like one has the pointed end and one has the wedge type in there. And it's time to say pluck it to bad brows. This tweezer set contains one slanted tweezer for precise plucking and one pointed tweezer to isolate a single hair in a large area. The long handle provides a more controlled tweeze. MSRP of $18. Okay, last up in my BoxyCharm is by Dragon Beauty. And this is the Dragonfire Color Corrector. This color corrector helps to conceal, correct, and perfect the appearance of dark circles, discoloration, and blemishes saturated with vitamin E and vitamin A. It blends effortlessly and offers customizable light to full coverage. To make your makeup look even more flawless, apply it anywhere you'd like to correct and naturalize, no, neutralize, and blend with a flat concealer brush or beauty sponge. After it sets, apply foundation as normal. And this is $25. And this is green, okay. So, has a doe foot applicator. Okay. All right. So that was BoxyCharm. I'm not terribly impressed with the BoxyCharm. I mean, I like, I, I can't wait to try this one. So, we'll be trying this one later. Probably I'll try it out tonight. And then I would love to play around with the eyeshadow palette. Okay. I have two left. Goodness, I already went through one, two, three, four, five. Jeez, I already went through five. We've got Cosbox and Vela Box. I'm going to go ahead. Let's open Cosbox first because that will take longer. And we can finish off on a short, quick, sweet note. Cosbox is a quarterly subscription and they are $50 a month. Or, I'm sorry, everything else was monthly. This one is quarterly. So they are $50 quarterly. And like I said in the beginning, this is the spring box. I love their boxes though. That is so pretty. So inside we have, yes. I, I mean, seriously, isn't that just a pretty design on their box? And their boxes you can turn inside out. Okay, and every box comes with their catalog. And it will show you about, it will tell you about your product that you got and about the other products that you had choices of. First up, we'll get a print postcard. This is a design by the artist that designed the box, both the inside and outside, and they do a they feature an artist every quarter. Into the big stuff, we've got a canvas tote. And actually, this is, when I picked this one, I was not as excited about it as I am now that I have it. Because I don't necessarily need a bunch of random crappy plastic grocery totes or really chintzy even fabric totes but this one actually is a very nice quality canvas very thick um, well done seams and pockets galore there's four on the outside so two on the sides and two on the front and there is three two smaller ones on the inside on the side 
and one larger pocket on the front part of the inside, as well as a zipper pouch. Nice leather straps, very durable, good book bag, good picnic bag. And this is by Feed Projects Canvas Market Tote. This is a $108 value and your choices were between the different colors. So there's the different colors there. It was a set of white. No, that's a gray. Glacial gray, coastal stripe, and sea blue. And I picked the sea blue. Next, you got a choice of three different items. And it was a choice between Palm and Perkins set of four upcycled napkins for $38 value, Diff Charitable Eyewear, an $85 value, or a Nimble Champ Light Portable Charger for $49.95 value. And that's those there. Here's the towels, here's the chargers, and there's the glasses. And I chose the charger and I got to pick the color in mine. So this is my charger and it came with the cord and instructions. And it looks like you can plug in your charger for your phone or whatnot on this side. And this is how you will charge it. Our next item that everyone got is the This Works Stress Check Sleep Spray. And this is a $25 value fast-acting vegan sleep spray with lavender lavender and chamomile essential oils and I said this is a $25 value that's not bad I like that smell the next item that was a choice of three different things the first thing to choose from was a 16 ounce collapsible cup from Stojo, or you could have chosen from Maji Sports Stretch and Exercise Bands Pack of Three, or you could have chosen Glass Ladder and Company Catherine Tech Organizer Roll, which is what I chose, and that is a $35 value, which in that category happens to be the more expensive of the three. But I don't need another cup, and I already have exercise bands. So I chose this. And I'm not sure if I'll keep it or not. We'll see. And these this does just roll up to a roll in tuck, and you're good to go. The next thing that was a choice product, you had choice from by Pure, the Lit Mist Illuminating Setting Spray, or from Province Apothecary, their Re Regenerating Exfoliator and Resurfacing Mask, or from Three Ships, their Lip Treatment Kit, which is a $30 value, and that is what I chose. This is a hydrating and exfoliating lip kit. Oh, so we got a two-step process here. So the vanilla is the exfoliator and a buttercream is the hydrating lip mask. And the last thing that I received is something that I chose and was able to choose only because I opted to receive my box earlier because I didn't necessarily need what the option to have a later shipping time was, which their option is a nail care duo, but instead I opted to receive my box sooner. So I have the Wild Cognac facial cleansing sponge. So just soak the sponge in lukewarm water 
add cleanser or soap onto your sponge if desired. You want soft massage onto skin in a circular motion and rinse thoroughly when done. So it has a little hanger so you can hang it on a hook in the shower to dry. It is a hard sponge right now but when it when it gets wet it will soften up quite nicely. And this you can find in their shop. They don't, since it wasn't an original product that they were going to include, then they don't have the product pricing on here, but they do sell this in their shop. So that was my cause box for spring. Yay, I love cause box. Now we have Vela box. Vela Box is a monthly candle subscription. They have three different subscription levels. At a $10 level, you will get a four ounce candle. The $20 level, you will get the eight ounce candle. And at a $30 level, you will get both the 10 and, I'm sorry, at the $30 level, you will get both the four and eight ounce candles. And all of those subscriptions get the free bonus gift each month. And Hope, if it had a scent, would smell like spring, like rain, like something new and alive. Quote by Jennifer Rush. So each month, they send their candles in these little canvas bags, and these things are awesome. They're perfect to store jewelry in, to store little trinkets in. I have a stash of them in a drawer over there that I just keep and reuse. So we'll start out with the candle that everybody, the scent that everybody gets. And the candles this month are by Bear Candle Co. And this one is the Avocado and Mint. These are hand poured soy wax. And this is out of Douglasville, Georgia. That is different. I definitely smell the mint in there. Just your standard cotton wick in a amber glass jar with a metal lid. And for our four ounce, also by Bear Candle Company, rain and sugar cane. Oh, that's interesting. That is very interesting. Same standard cotton wick wax. Black lid, amber glass jar. And then our free gift for this month are dwarf marigold seeds. Cute, cute. So a little bit about Bear Candle Co. They are located in Douglasville, Georgia, and Bear Candle Company is run by full-time college student Ashlyn. Her goal is to keep candles as they should be, simple. Ashlyn and her team create each candle by hand from wicking to pouring to labeling and even shipping. Each Bear Candle is crafted with only the best ingredients and all made in the U.S. And with the seeds. These are from Bentley Seed Company in Cambridge, New York. Since 1975, they've been in business to grow good things. In a world where more is generally better, they look at it from a different angle, carrying less varieties, writing, growing instructions for those with less space, and designing packaging in ways to make the gardening process less stressful. The avocado mint this has garden mint, jasmine, neroli, and lemon peel. Fresh and light like a happy spring day. Let the sunshine in, enjoy a tasty breakfast, some avocado toast perhaps, and make today awesome with this one burning nearby. And then with the rain and sugar cane, dewy citrus, lush greens, sugar, and musk. For those rainy spring days when you just want to be lazy, you block out the world to just listen to the melodic rainfall through the window screens. Candles lit, eyes closed, just enjoying life's simple pleasures. Well, that was all for my unboxing today. I hope you guys enjoyed having seven, 
seven different boxes opened. Something for just about everyone, I do believe. And if you're looking for a gift for anybody, check these out. And I will leave the links to everything down in the description box below. Let me know what you thought, and we'll catch you next time. Hope you guys all have a wonderful, wonderful rest of your day. Bye.